John, it's a um, well battled three points. Um, how do you see the 90 minutes? A really difficult game. Um, well battled is probably a good way to look at it. Look, we, um, I thought we struggled to start the game for 10 15 minutes. Um, couldn't really get going, but I think in those moments it's really important that you don't give up too many opportunities, you battle away, um, you defend, you work hard and we did that and then we came into the game and the rest of the first half I thought obviously get the goal and then had one or two wee opportunities higher up the pitch. Second half I would describe battling, um, didn't think we were too pretty, I think we can be loads better on the ball but in terms of, of fighting, um, covering each other, defending the box. Um, it was it was really really good and everything you want and sometimes it takes performances like that to to get a win so delighted with the win performance with the ball could it be better yeah a lot better uh, and we will but without the ball I said I thought we worked ever so hard and um, delighted with three points penalty was a key incident it came at the back of a, a, a possible claim seconds yeah. earlier how did you view that I didn't see it the the well I seen it but I've not seen it back the the guys in the bench they thought it could have been a penalty the first one um, and obviously we. Um, the opposite side we get it that's what we've been asking today we need to get more more people in the box make people defend more um, and didn't do it all game but the couple of times that we've got Lewis Gibson high up the pitch he can be a threat and he managed to get us a penalty and, and Dylan tucked it away the, the other big decision across the game was the red card um, I, I guess I'm I think they haven't seen the incident back it speaks for itself yep. but what I'm really interested in is the reaction of your players because when there's that kind of dynamic of you have an advantage of a player yep. it can play tricks in the mind yeah. and your your players played their cards well. Yeah, they did look it's important at that point that you still keep doing the right things, you move the ball, you don't get sloppy. Um because you I think you can maybe start to overplay a bit thinking that they've um you can just keep the ball off them. They kept players up the pitch so they were still a threat. Um we had like three or four moments where we could be better when we were breaking forward, obviously at the bar and a couple of wee things but we could have maybe killed the game off at that point because they'll throw balls in the box. They're a lot bigger than us and stronger today because their players are injured. Um, so we had to defend um, and we did that really really well and I'd say them, I'm delighted with the, with the performance With the somewhat uh, depleted squad that we had today um, I think before the game I think the mantra that was hearing from Rover supporters is we'll take a point we'll take a point yeah. we'll come away with three what, what does that say about the resiliency of the squad here? Yeah look, we made the point before the game I think we need to start believing again I don't know why but there's been a little bit of um, I don't know how to put a finger on it it's just not been that wee um, that feel good factor maybe not maybe not so much that but we just needed to come and start believing and start trusting that we're, that we're a really good team uh, and we are I said we can do both sides of the game I said today was a, was a battle performance but we can we can also play as well so um, look we've got guys who are injured we'll have three guys back fingers crossed um, before the the, the United game um, and a couple of guys that were slightly longer but as I said it's important the squad's important and um, we've got a couple of young players on there Lewis Gibson came on to you coming on the pitch and starting the game that they're important they're a big part of that squad so the squad's the most important thing everybody's needed um, and it was, it was true today I'll put the question to you but I think that the realists uh, among us all know that, that it's more important how you answer this question than either the United game mm. but we've got time for recuperation and recovery expecting with three players back? Yeah, so uh, hopefully, fingers crossed, Paul Hanlon, Scott Brown, Louis Vaughan are, are there or thereabouts. Um, Callum for Dice and Jack Hammond will be out a little bit longer. Um, so time frame, not too sure, but um, I said those three, we I would expect you back. Look, things can happen, um, but touch with the three of them, we should be back doing a little bits of training and back out on the pitch, which they are at the moment, next next week, and then hopefully get some good training in the week before the United game. First three points to the campaign always kind of gets the monkey off the back a wee bit for, for every team across all divisions. Um, congratulations on managing to achieve that today. Cheers, David. Thank you.